There was one time when I actually felt that I was meant to start leading worship with an instrument. And I had grown up playing keys, and I'd felt it for a little bit that I should actually be playing, and also just encouraging to the young girls within our team that you can be a, a lady worship leader and actually be good at an instrument and play. So I practiced and I was like, like a bit nervous, but I was excited. And then just before we hopped up on um, platform, I got really nervous and so then I just quickly stuck down a little cheat sheet of the chords of the song that I was going to be leading from the keys. And as I pushed it down, I, f I felt like I might have accidentally pressed a button, but I was like, oh, it, I'm sure it's fine, it's fine. And I didn't think anything of it, so then um, the keys is forward and then we've, we've done like song one and two and then between two and three I grab my microphone and I'm praying and I'm like, thank you Jesus. Thank you that we get to have moments in your presence and then it changes us from the inside out. So we praise you, Jesus. Just kidding, we're not gonna worship to that. And then I just think, oh, maybe I just did something wrong. I may need someone up here just to maybe fix this up. Yep. <laughs> I'm so sorry, church. We're gonna go into worship in one second. I feel like Jad taught me that in those moments you should just use it to your advantage and when you try and be serious and just pretend like nothing happened, it just makes it so bad because people feel awkward, they don't know where they can laugh. And so we end up just singing and, it, it, you know, people responded <laughs> kindly. 